Let's see how to enter floor plan in Beardmaster using input plan option. Let's take a sample plan in which all walls are 230 mm thick and all beams are 230 mm wide. From this typical floor plan, a beam center line is drawn. Here, beam center lines matching with wall center lines. Next, we have to mark a grids in X and Y directions with respect to origin. So, we have marked 4 X grids and 5 Y grids. In Beardmaster, click on floor, then click select floor. So, we will select a typical floor. Click OK. Again, go to floor menu and select input plan option. For drawing the center line plan, three commands are available. First is line command, second is rectangle command, and third is mesh command. So here we will use mesh command. Click on draw menu, click on mesh. We will select a random mesh. Here we have to enter x values and y values. First we will enter x values one by one. Click on add row. So there are total 4 x grids. So enter 4. Click add. The first x1 value is 0. x2 is 2.37. Then 5.45. And 9.91. Click OK. Then we will add y values. So there are total 5 y values. Click add. Y1 is 0. Y2 is 1.37. Then Y3 is 4.54. Y4 is 5.7. And Y5 is 9.8. After entering all values, click OK. Again, click OK to continue. So this is the random mesh displayed. In this mesh, unwanted lines can be removed using erase command. So this is the erase command. Click on erase and select the lines. Now to draw a line at a distance of 2.23 meter, we will use offset command. So this is offset command. Click on offset. Then first select the line. Then enter the value 2.23 meters. Then we have to pick a side. Select on pick side. Now we will select a downside of the line selected. Now to draw a new line to, for joining centers of existing lines, we will use again line command. Select midpoint option from object snap toolbar. So this is midpoint option. Then we will select the lines. This is how we have entered a single line plan. The next step is placing of columns. To place columns, select column command and place them appropriately. To convert this graphical data into numerical data, we will use make data command. Click on program will ask default sizes for beams, slabs, columns and walls. So enter the minimum desired sizes. Program will increase the sizes during design if they are insufficient. Now click OK. The program has calculated beams, columns, slabs and total number of nodes. Again click OK. Here all the slabs and beams are identified by program and number them serially. To see more details, go to view menu. Click on view. Click show numbers. Here we will select column numbers and grid numbers. Click OK. In this way, our input plan is ready. Lastly, go to file menu and click on save.